All right, y'all, Coach Noah here, and today we are going to do a how-to on warm-ups. I've had this talk with a couple people recently about how should we warm up for squatting with a barbell, something like that, uh, could be some Olympic lifts. This is for strength work, specifically uh, where we have a known number that we're going for, or even maybe just a range. So some things to keep in mind. First, warming up is an art, it is not a science. There are not really perfect prescriptions about what should I do for my first warm up set and my second warm up set when we warm up, and everybody's gonna be a little different. Some people may enjoy more warm ups, some people may like less warm ups, some people may like to get much closer to their working weight, some people like to stay a little further or make bigger jumps to their working weight. You're gonna figure out over time what works for you and that works. Whatever works for you is, is what you should do. Don't feel like you have to do something you know, specifically because somebody else is doing it uh, or you saw in a program that it's supposed to be, you know, start with 50% of the what you're gonna do for this much. It's up to you, it's up to the feel of the user. I always like to start people with an empty barbell. Let's use back squatting as an example today. If we're gonna back squat a working set, which means the thing I'm going to count and log and that's what's gonna get me stronger. If I'm gonna do a working set of say 150 pounds for five reps, I'm gonna start with the empty barbell for five reps. If I'm a 500 pound squatter, I'm gonna start with the empty barbell. If I'm a 100 pound squatter, I'm gonna start with the empty barbell, okay? So we're always gonna start there. Don't throw weight on the bar to start, start light. After that, one of the things that we always like to talk about is we don't want our appetizer to ruin our dinner. So using that 150 pound example, if I'm squatting 150 for five reps and maybe I'm gonna do three to five sets of that, uh, I don't wanna do a ton of warm-ups at 140 pounds. To my body, 140 pounds and 150 pounds feel very, very similar. So maybe I'll start with a set with the empty barbell for five reps like we talked about. Maybe after that, I will do 95 pounds for another five reps, or if I know that I don't like as much volume, maybe three reps. Maybe I'll add a little more weight. I'll do 125 for maybe three reps. And then maybe I'll finish off with one rep at 140 or maybe even 145. Then I'll go into my working set at 150 pounds. One thing I like to think about as I warm up, uh, this was told me by my old buddy, my old mentor, David Osorio from CrossFit South Brooklyn, is a sort of uh, spectrum of what I'm thinking about as I do this warm up. And it is called position, balance, tension, and then focus. So when I start with that empty barbell or in my lighter sets, I start thinking about position. If I'm squatting, where is my chest? Where are my hips? What is my back doing? Am I nailing my positions? Do I feel like I am in a good position? As I start adding a little weight and I start getting a little more feedback from some weight, I start thinking about balance. Where is the balance in my feet? Where am I driving through? Is the bar tracing a straight path up and down as I move? As the weight starts to increase, I start thinking about tension. Am I getting a big breath and a tight belly, a squeezed midline through the rep? Am I creating tension outward with my knees, say in my squat, or maybe if I'm deadlifting, am I keeping tension in my lats as I pull, right? Now I've got more weight on the bar and I can start practicing that. The very last thing we're gonna practice is focus, or we can even think about it as intensity. That last rep, my last warm up set should be one rep. It should be very close to what we're gonna do for the working set, and I should try to absolutely annihilate that last rep. Right? The goal there is it's like your dress rehearsal. It is a confidence builder. It's what I'm gonna do to feel like I am absolutely gonna rock my work sets. So don't go in and do that last rep that's really close to what you're gonna do that day and could be fairly heavy lackadaisically. I wanna do it like I am in a competition. I unrack that bar with some ferocity. I've got a ton of focus. I you know, squat it or deadlift it or whatever I'm doing with you know, basically as much uh, power and focus as I can bring to bear, and that should leave me going into my uh, working sets 
feeling really good, really confident, like I'm going to smash through whatever I'm doing that day. So that's warming up in a nutshell. Again, remember, art, not a science. Start with that empty barbell. Don't let your appetizer ruin your dinner and follow that little spectrum and have a little fun. Stay safe. Did I say a little fun? Have a lot of fun. Stay safe and I'll see you soon. Later. Oh, 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 oh,